cross my heart, hope to die. Hey everyone, it's Wednesday, which means it's my turn to make a video. And since I've been making very, very little videos on my other channel, I'm definitely going to not miss this one. And I am really sorry if you are a subscriber of Cupcake6795. I have so much homework to do. I even have so much homework to do today, but I could not skip this video. I had to do it, so... Okay, so let's do my outfit of the day first. I just wore my hair curly, and I used some stuff that I'm going to mention in a second in my favorites, which I like because it made my hair bring out its natural wavy -ness. It's not really curly. It's like wavy-ish, curly-ish. And I wore a little flower clip in my hair right here, so it was look like this with a little flower, um, white flower, but it's downstairs and I can't get it right now, so I'm just going to, so I just left my hair down. Then I'm just wearing my normal heart necklace. And then for my top, I am wearing this little, um, little, it's like, I guess it's like a shirt cardigan. You can use it for both. And it has these, like, weird sleeves, if you can see. I didn't really like them at first. Like, when I bought it, I liked it, and then I didn't like it. But now I kind of like it again because it's just, like, different, you know? And the back looks like this. It's just, um, one second. You can see... It looks like that, and I think that's really cute. So, that's what the shirt looks like in the back. And then I am wearing this belt, and it's just from Target, and I just have to wear it with these pants. And then the pants look like this. I didn't like that. And they are folded at the bottom, if you can see, because they're way too long for me. And then for shoes, I wore... Look how much hair I have. Oh, I wore these... Murano shoes from Target. Yes, white shoes. Okay, so let's get on with the favorites. Okay, so I have more than five favorites. That's how many you're supposed to do this week, but I've been making videos on my other channel, so I decided to do more than five. Okay, so some are beauty related and some are not really. Okay, so my first favorite is my hair product that I used today. For the, um, I took a shower and then I it just, this is how it looked after it air dried. So this is air dried hair. And I use this Herbal Essence Totally Twisted Curl Boosting Mousse. It has a really good fragrance. It's a tropical mystique fragrance. Mm. And it's number two extra. So this is what it looks like. It's kind of shiny if you can like see that. Yeah, that's what it looks like. And it has like a little nozzle like this. And I really like it. It smells so good. And um, the shampoo smells amazing too. And the conditioner. And I use that. So I bought the, a new bottle of shampoo and conditioner for cross country for getting ready in the morning, just like a little smaller bottles, and I got this for free. Or actually it was like 10 cents, but still. Okay, so I love this stuff. It's um, it's a different kind of mousse. It gets really, it gets more like liquidy, I guess, or um, like when you puff down on it, it gets more like liquidy, so you have to like scrunch fast, but I really like it. And it works just as good as my other Garnier for cheese one or better, and it smells way better. Okay, so next, I've been using this all of August, and this is my Dream Matte Powder from Maybelline New York, and this is, I used to use the um, Mineral Power from Maybelline, but now I use this one, and this is in Beige Medium 2 to 2.5. This is what it looks like. That's my color, and it's matte, which I really like, and it, it actually has some good coverage, so that's what my color looks like, so it matches my skin well. And I really like this stuff. I use it every day, and um, I always wear powder. Um, I don't wear foundation anymore because I don't have time in the morning to put it on at cross country. I just use my Dream Mousse Concealer and cover up blemishes and stuff like that. So I always had to use my Dream Matte Powder. Yes, I love this stuff. Okay, and next favorite is my Sense Hydrating Toner. This is in my nighttime routine video, and uh, I just posted that. And this smells it smells very fresh, but it is just a toner, and I just started using a different toner because my other toner, I don't think it, I mean, it works good, but I've been using it for a while, so I just decided to try a different one, and I really like this one so far. Um, it just seems to clean my face well, and it's very hydrating, and makes my skin soft, and it makes it have more, um, it makes it more oily because my it might look like I have oily skin right now, but I really don't have oily skin. Only it's oily from the products I use or if it's sweaty or something. And it might be kind of gross right now because I just ran earlier. So I had to change back into my outfit. So yeah, that's what it looks like. Okay. 
Next favorite is this Strap Perfect. Okay, so these are the Strap Perfect things, and this is what one looks like. If you can see, that's what it looks like. And it comes in clear, black, skin colored. I think that's it, but it comes in like two of each, I think. And so, yeah, these are such lifesavers. If you wear like um, Razorback tanks, or if you wear um, just any tank top where you really don't want to show your bra strap, you just have to. You just put it in this and it like slips in here, if you can see. It like slips in here and it's on both these sides so it's like this on the back. And it is so convenient and I can wear like all these different shirts now because of this. And with a regular bra and it's just perfect. And if I wear a strapless bra and then like, um, I'm wearing like two today. I'm wearing like a little over shirt because I had to wear it with this um, cardigan. But yeah, you can use it for both, or you can just wear a strapless bra and then one of these and just use it for that, and that works really well. I love these strap perfects. They're really good. You should get them, and they're only like $9 for like six of them. Okay, so next favorite is my Lip Smackers in Strawberry Watermelon. This is like the candy kind, candy, um, uh, candy flavored lip gloss, and oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I love this stuff. It doesn't really have a color at all. Well, it, it looks like this on the camera, but it is amazing. It smells amazing. It tastes amazing. It is amazing. It's just like a really good chapstick. And I don't like wearing, I don't really wear lip gloss or um, lipstick that much. So for me, chapstick is like a must have. And especially with cross country, I don't have as much time. So I just swipe it on and I'm done. And it's perfect. And it's really worn out too, if you can see. But this is perfect. I love it. And it smells amazing. Okay, so next is something I'm really into lately is white eyeliner. I love white eyeliner because I can put it on my waterline, and I put it right here in the V. It's like this little V. Uh, the cheer duct, right? I call it the little V. And then I rub it in, and right now it's really used down. I need to sharpen it, if you can see right there. But, um, yeah, I really need to sharpen that. But when I sharpen it, it works a lot better. And I've heard the Wet n Wild ones are good. Those are cheap. And these are like $3 or $3.99. These work good too. I like the NYX eyeliners. They're not the best ones. I think I like Rimmel better than NYX. But they work good. They're like good for the money. So I like this one. And this is in White Pearl. I probably mentioned this a million times in my Cupcake 6795 views. And last but not least is my... Harry Potter book, and this is Harry Potter 7 and the Deathly Hollows. Why am I reading this? Of course I know this, by J.K. Rowling. And this is what the, like, there's, like, a cover on it, but I, like, take that off so I can just read it. And this is, like, yeah. Okay, this book is absolutely amazing. Okay, so if anyone didn't know, I'm a Harry Potter nerd. I'm obsessed with Harry Potter, like, obsession. Like, every summer, I read the series over again. I read... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, and then in August I read 7, which took me like not very long, maybe a couple days, because I listened to the audiobook um, with it too, because I get audiobooks for free. Don't even ask us how, because I don't want to get in trouble with the internet, or with everything. So if you're watching this, yeah, I'm just going to stop now so I don't get in trouble. So, yeah. So, yeah. So that is my last favorite, and you should go read the Harry Potter books because they're amazing, and I love Harry Potter, and I cannot wait till the seventh movie. So, so excited. I am, like, freaking out. Freaking out. Not freaking out. That sounds weird. Okay. And I'm freaking out, and I'm going to the 12 o'clock showing, or the midnight. I am going to do it. I have to do it. So, yeah. Sorry if this video is a little bit long for an alpha of the day slash favorites, but, yeah. Sorry about that. See you guys later. Bye.